Hello everyone. Today we shall continue our course of learning uh, of formal language at Mother and Congress. And uh, I recall you that our course you can find in my website. Today will be lecture number nine. Lecture about the power series. And you can find also uh, this course in Ukrainian language in my website. So we shall start. So we have lecture number nine. Uh, our lecture today we will be the what to the power series. The power series is a variable t associated to the sequence a n of real numbers is uh, the formal theorem. So they f t is equal theorem of uh, a n uh, t in power n for n. Um, from 0, 1, 2, and so on. Given a real number r, the series is set to converge to the value r of t if the, theorem, the following theorem is well defined and is finite. Otherwise, f of t is, is said to diverge for t is equal to uh, r. The radius of convergence of the power series ft is infinite if ft converges for all real numbers r otherwise it is the non-negative real numbers rho such that ft converges for um, r from 0 uh, to rho and divergence for uh, R greater rho. It can be shown that rho is equal to the limit when n turns to infinity of the uh, infimum such modular in, in the power uh, 1 divide n. The series may be convergence or divergence for t is equal r for r greater or equal zero and less uh, rho the convergence uh, the series convergence this defines a function from the interval zero rho into the non-negative integers for example the series the t in power uh, uh, n for uh, for positive integer for non-negative integer n defined on the interval 0 1 the rational function uh, which uh, posit uh, t um, the value of 1 divided to uh, 1 minus t uh, the series uh, uh, t power on device to n the power alpha has radius of convergence 1 for any positive real numbers alpha. It is known that uh, uh, diverge for t equal 1 when alpha is uh, less uh, 2 and to converge um, when alpha is uh, greater or equal 2. Power series, as considered as here, a special case of formal series when the alphabet is a singleton. In particular, um, the usual operation of theorem, product, and, and star hold also in this case. Given a set X, capital of work, our and alphabet uh, A capital, the the uh, generating series of x is the power series, such power series, f of x, uh, x t, theorem of cardinality of intersection um, x uh, with um, a capital in power uh, t, uh, power n uh, multiply t in power n, where n 
and, and belongs to the non-negative integer. Since if all um, n non-negative integer, one has the cardinality is of the intersection of x with a capital in power n is less or equal k in power n with a k is equal to the cardinality of alphabet a capital. It follows that the radius of convergence f sub x capital is at least one divided k. The sequence un, where un is the cardinality of the intersection x capital with uh, a capital power on is called the Lange distribution of the set S capital. Proposition. Let f of t uh, a and t n be a power series with a non-negative uh, non real uh, coefficients and with the finite radius of convergence rho and let g of t is a mapping from z, z, um, interval 0 rho to um, non-negative real numbers r plus and be a function defined for uh, uh, for uh, uh, r from 0 uh, from interval uh, 0 rho by the, the following way then f rho is equal the limit when r turns to rho with r less of rho of uh, gr. In particular, both uh, uh, quantities are simultaneously finite or infinite. The proof. Suppose uh, first that f of t converges for t is equal to rho and set s is equal to f of rho. Given epsilon, there exists an um, integer um, and capital such that s n is equal to a0, a1 rho plus so on plus a n capital rho in power n capital satisfies the inequality s is uh, greater or equal s n greater s minus epsilon device 2. Uh, we put p t is equal um, a0 plus 1 uh, a1 t plus 1 plus uh, n uh, n uh, t in power n. There exist a real numbers r with r less than rho such so that um, s n is greater or equal p t which is um, greater s n minus epsilon divided 2. For uh, r uh, equal or less x uh, which is uh, less rho one has f of f rho is greatest of uh, fx is equal gx is um, greater or equal gr which is uh, greater pr which is greater sn minus epsilon uh, device 2 is uh, greater or equal p uh, fp minus epsilon this shows that uh, g is a function gx tends to f uh, Rho when x tends to rho. Next, if uh, f of rho is infinite, then uh, for each um, uh, positive uh, real numbers, m there exists an integer n such so that s n is equal a0 plus a1 rho plus 1 plus a n rho in power n is uh, which is greater to uh, m satisfies the inequality s n is greater to m set again pt is equal a0 plus 1 uh, a1 t plus 1 plus a n t in power n there exist a real numbers r with uh, r is less of rho such so that um, p of r is uh, greater uh, as n divided 2. For r less or equal x uh, which is um, less of r one has 
f of x is equal g of x is great or equal gr which is um, greater than pr which is greater as s and divide 2 is uh, greater or equal m this shows that uh, g of x tend to infinity when x tend to rho this complete our as a proof of our proposition therefore for a power series f of t um, and assume uh, of uh, a n t in power n where n be, uh, belongs to um, whole non-negative integer with a non-negative coefficient and the radius of convergence rho we can denote by the expression fr for r uh, greater or equal zero and uh, less or equal rho in the differently this assume um, a n r n when n uh, belongs to the set of positive integer and the value of the function defined by f for t is equal r with the properties that both values is simultaneously finite or infinite uh, we know that this statement only holds because the coefficients a n are non negative. Indeed, consider for example the um, power series f of t is equal the sum uh, uh, under the uh, positive integer n uh, minus 1 in power n t power n. Here, uh, the radius of convergence is 1 and g of t is equal 1 divided to 1 plus t. Uh, we gave g of 1 is equal um, 1 divided 2. Also, at f of t, divergence for t is equal 1. A power series f of t is assume of non negative integer a n t n with real coefficients can be uh, derivated formally. The result is the series. Uh, assume uh, n belongs to all the, the set of uh, non-negative integer a n t in uh, power a n minus 1 denoted by f prime of t. Let rho be the radius of the convergence of t for r less of rho phi, uh, fa, uh, f uh, prime of r is equal to the value at rho of the derivative of the function defined by f. Uh, a proposition 1h2 uh, imply, which was proved be, um, below, uh, implies the following proposition. Let f of t, this is assume f of a1 t in power n be the, uh, the power series with non negative real convent, uh, coefficients. Let rho be the radius of uh, convergence of the power series, power series f. Then um, f prime of rho is equal to the sum uh, as assume um, uh, uh, of uh, by uh, n belongs to the set of the uh, non-negative integer of such n multiply a n rho in the power n minus 1. The next proposition gives a method for computing the radius of convergences of the star of the power series. Proposition 1 uh, H4. Let f of t in the sum of a n t in power n be the power series with the non negative real coefficients and with the constant terms 0. Consider the power series d of t, um, which is equal 1 divided to 1 minus f of t, which is equal the sum from n from. Uh, uh, from the positive uh, non negative integer f um, of t in the power n, which is uh, the star of the power series f of t, and uh, denoted by p uh, sub f and uh, sorry, uh, rho sub f and rho sub g, the radius of convergence of f and uh, g respectively. Th then rho of, uh, sub g is less or equal to rho of, sub uh, f and if rho uh, sub g 
uh, less uh, rho sub f than rho sub g is the unique positive real number such that f uh, um, of rho g is equal 1. The proof. The coefficients of the power series g of t are greater than the equal to those of uh, f of t. So we have that the, ray, uh, the rho of g is uh, less or equal to rho uh, f. Assume now that uh, rho g less rho f. Then the series f of t converges for r is equal to rho g. We use the fact that uh, the the power series f of t defines the continuous function inside its interval of convergence. Suppose first that f of r is less of 1, then there exists a real number s with the property that r is less s, uh, s is less rho of f, so that f of s is less 1. This implies that uh, g of s is less of infinity, which uh, contradicts the fact that s is greater rho g. Suppose next that f of r is the greatest 1. There exists a real number s with um, uh, such a, which is uh, positive and uh, less of r, so that f of s is greater of one. This implies that um, g of s is equal infinity, which contradicts the fact that s uh, is less rho of g. Therefore, we get that f of rho is equal 1. f of r is equal 1. Thank you. This completes our proof. And uh, we finish our lecture. Um, so, I wish you a good health. Good luck and uh, goodbye.